finding the sum, sum means add, of an arithmetic series using the formula Sn equals n over 2 bracket 2a plus n minus 1 times d. The n is the number of terms in the sequence. So for example you might be asked to find the sum of the first 50 terms of the sequence which would mean technically adding the first 50 terms together because sum means add. The a represents the first term of that sequence and the d represents the difference, the common difference between each term. So we want to find the sum of the first 50 terms of the sequence 5, 7, 9, 11. And we're going to use this formula to do it. Sn equals n over 2 times 2a plus bracket n minus 1 bracket d. Um, the n represents the number of terms, in this case it'll be 50. The a represents the first term, in this case it'll be 5. And the D represents the common difference. So from 5 to 7, 7 to 9, 9 to 11, the difference is 2. Now another way that they can phrase this, instead of asking you to find the first 50 terms, or the sum of the first 50 terms, is they might ask you to find S50. So instead of saying SN, they'll say find S50. And it just means the exact same thing. So we have our formula. And we have our values that have to go in place of our variables. So n is 50, a is 5, and d is 2. So whenever we're doing any substitution, the best thing to do is to write out the formula as you see it and replace every letter with a set of brackets. So the n gets swapped for 50. So inside this set of brackets here, I've got 50. And then the other n is here, so inside this set of brackets I've also got 50. The a gets swapped for 5, because 5 was the first term. So inside there we've got 5. And the d gets swapped for 2, because the common difference between each term was 2. So once we've substituted all our values into our formula, then we just have to start working it out. So 50 divided by 2 is 25. 2 times 5 is 10. Fifty minus 1 is 49. And all that's times by 2. I'll do that part in the next step. Okay. So obviously I'm following BODMAS or BIMDAS each time, whichever you like to call it. So I'm going to work out what's inside the brackets first. Now you can just stick all of this into your calculator. But just in case you'd like to see it out step by step. So inside the brackets we've got 10 plus 49 times 2. But we have to do our multiplication before our addition. And 49 times 2 is 98. So this becomes 25 multiplied by 108. Which ends up giving me 2700. So that is my answer. If I was to add together the first 50 terms of this sequence, I'd end up getting to 2,700. So we want to find the sum of the first 30 terms this time of the sequence 7, 10, 13 and 16. And again, we're going to use our series formula, which is in our tables, again on page 22. And again, another way that they can phrase this question is find S30. Instead of saying SN, they'll say find S30, which means find the sum of the first 30 terms. 
So again, we have to decide what is the N, what is the A, and what is the D. So the N is going to be the number of terms, which is 30, that's given in the question. The A is going to be the first term of the sequence, which is 7. And the D is going to be the common difference to get from 7 to 10, 10 to 13, 13 to 16, what's happening each time. We're going up in 3, so D is equal to 3. So again, we're just going to write out our formula, swapping every letter for a set of brackets, and then we'll substitute into those brackets. So the N is 30. So 30 is going to go in here and also in here. The A is 7. So we're going to put A in here. We're going to put 7 in there. And then the D is 3. So we're swapping this D for 3. And then we just have to work out our numbers. You can put it into the calculator or do it step by step. If you do it step by step you have to make sure you follow bomb das or bid mass or bird mass as it's now called. Okay 30 divided by 2 is 15. 2 by 7 is 14. 30 minus 1 is 29 and that's going to be multiplied by 3. So again, we follow BIMDAS, or BODMAS. So we're going to do what's inside the brackets, but inside the brackets, we have some adding and some multiplying. So we do the multiplying first. And 29 times 3 is 87. So again, we do inside the brackets. 14 plus 87, 101. And then 15 times 101 is 1,515. So the sum of the first 30 terms of this sequence, 7, 10, 13, 16, dot, 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 if we were to add them all together, the first 13 term, 30 terms will end up at 1,515.